Hey there guys, today we're taking a look at Fallout New Vegas running on the 1135G7. Now, I actually played the entirety of the game on this chip. I've been doing that just over the past few weeks just because of the fact that I love playing this game and it's one of those games that runs really, really well on this chip. One thing to note though is that when you first launch a Bethesda game, it tries to automatically set settings for you and what it defaulted to was the highest quality settings but at 720p, which I agree is a pretty solid configuration because the game looks perfectly fine at 720p and with the high quality settings you do get back a lot of the detail and stuff because this right now is currently at 1080p with the lowest possible settings now i reloaded my save and i'm just running through the ending section so i have the most op stuff i actually have god mode on right now just because i'm over encumbered because i'm carrying so many weapons with me so pretty much this was just a load of the save that i was doing recently and i had a few mods in there just the ones that let you have like multiple companions and stuff like that nothing too heavy and the game handled it perfectly fine so it's just one of those things where the game runs pretty decently it has a bit of a stutter here and there but it's only really in the really large areas in interiors like this you're not going to really notice any problems or anything like that you'll see that the one percent lows are kind of low but that's actually just because of the fact that when you're loading in from one area to the other it will drop those one percent loads but you'll see that the averages stay pretty much almost consistently at or near 60. it's just going to be one of those things where the game is super playable on here and i mean you'd expect it at this point the game is like over a decade old but it's still my favorite fallout game and i come back and play this multiple times like every few years at least you know like I'll start a playthrough, I'll have a blast through there, and I'll just start another one, load up some new mods in there, and just try out just new stuff in there. So there's so much content in this game. It's such a classic, and I love it, and I'm glad that it runs so well on a chip like this. I think these are the kinds of games that really bring out the potential of these low power, but very, very strong CPU, or I guess you'd say APU. APU is an AMD term but really it's become so synonymous with a cpu with a G like an actually decent gpu paired together and this just goes to show that you can get really good performance in some really popular and really good games and you'll see like the game it's, or the chip itself is actually not stressing itself too much with this game specifically we're not even reaching well i currently have the chip set to 30 watts and it doesn't even go usually over 15 just because it runs so well and of course bethesda games they are almost always locked at 60 frames per second because they kind of tend to tie a lot of things like physics and stuff like that to the frame rate so you'll never see it go over 60 you don't really need it to so i'm just gonna let it play out for a bit more here but you'll be able to see what the performance is like overall i absolutely love this game i played the entirety of it on this chip so i can tell you for a fact that you will have a great experience on here it's just one of those games where i would recommend you try this out because you're gonna have a better experience playing this than something like fallout 4 on this chip so that is it for me today guys i want to say thank you for watching and be sure to subscribe if you haven't let me know what games you'd like to see i'm, I'm pretty much just gonna be taking a look at some older games just because i have been using this chip a lot just because sometimes i'll just be out and about and i'll have a little bit of time to play a game here and there and like this is one of those games that i love hopping into and just doing a, a quest here and there it's super fun to play and it does such a great job on this chip Alpha Squad reporting in. Thanks for the support. You're you. Let's get going. <laughs> 